cities of our planet are increasingly crowded and congested. It has become necessary to offer the citizens attractive public transport solutions providing a credible alternative to the automobile. Information technology is at the heart of tomorrow's public transport system. Networks will need to be more dynamic and open for users as well as operators. Within this perspective, here is how Veolia Environment Research and Innovation is working towards the harmonization of transport information systems, laying the groundwork for the buses of the future. It's important to know that until now, these information systems were unable to communicate amongst themselves. Therefore, organizing authorities and transport operators did not have access to intermodal information, so they could not deliver global information to the end user throughout their journey, independently of the mode of transport or operator in charge of a specific network. Our objective, therefore, consists in harmonizing data and language for systems to communicate between each other. The IT platform project is integrated into a wide-reaching European program called EBSF, the European Bus System of the Future, involving 52 European partners. Until now, the driver had access to different information from the onboard systems thanks to several displays integrated into the driving facilities at dashboard level. The IT platform project will allow the driver to access the same data through just one dashboard integrated desktop. Furthermore, until now, transport operators and organizing authorities had no access to intermodal information. Our work as integrators therefore consists in bringing together the expertise of different partners to create one integrated IT platform. The first results of this project are visible today throughout Madrid's public transport network. We are here in Madrid in the Consorcio Regional de Transportes de Madrid where we have implemented an IT platform that allows us to gather information from all transport modes in the region, uh, metro, light rail, commuter railway and urban buses, interurban buses. This is a very unique place in, the, in, in Europe because all the information we gather from, from the operators is on real time. We got uh, next departures, next arrivals, or even a breakdown, so we can manage to solve it as quick as possible. Also, we use the information to dispatch it to the user from different transport modes, either train or buses, and you can have in the same web page, in the same panel, in the same display, all the information from different transport modes. The users have access to information regarding their mode of transport, taking into account real-time operating conditions. They can therefore decide to select the most efficient means of transport to get to their destination. The IT platform project has also put a telediagnostic system into application in Brunois, in the suburbs of Paris. This telediagnostic system allows the public transport operator, through back office, to access the information concerning alerts or possible faults which could appear on board the vehicle. This information can be sourced in real time and is immediately accessible to the operator as soon as a breakdown occurs, but also allows monitoring of the working condition of a vehicle through the analysis of certain key parameters to anticipate breakdowns, achieving what we call predictive maintenance. For the first time, the IT platform project allows users to access real-time information on different modes of transport across Europe. 
a major innovation in public transport information management, which will allow, in due course, a more simple and fluid use of multiple and interconnected modes of transport in our cities.